So here's a new Renaissance solution right here at the Embedded World. And uh, hi, so who are you? Yeah, I'm Lars Mikan. I'm the business development manager for the industrial Ethernet module solution. We call it IJ45. And it's using uh, uh, ARM Cortex A7 uh, with the M3, stuff like this. Is it like this kind of solution right here? Um, Basically, it's uh, it's included in a in, in similar chip. Uh, it's uh, included the RIN32 solution. This uh, solution here is an uh, um, a new solution. What we have, what we show here, uh, for Which is industrial there? yeah for industrial Ethernet. Yeah. So here uh, you see an industrial Ethernet controller solution, and uh, the controller solution communicates uh, with different uh, slave. Solutions. Here you see a uh, solution yeah. with the IR with the IRJ45, and it's a an, uh, display solution where you uh, can control yeah. the speed of uh, the motor control engine. Yeah. So you're controlling the speed over the Ethernet system here. Right. You control the the speed of uh, this. Uh, and this. What is this? Yeah, this, uh, this solution here is uh, an uh, RZN T1, and uh, this RZN T1 controls uh, the, uh, the motor control, uh, the, the, the motor here, and uh, communicates uh, the values via Ethernet. So on this board, uh, what is this board? Is this uh, showing the module that you have right here? What is this module? Yes, uh, this, this here shows uh, the module. And the module is sold out on a solution kit board, which provides uh, different interfaces. We have here the USB interface to power the whole board, as well as we have here an Arduino interface, an Arduino shield, and an PMOD interface. And if you turn it around a little bit like this, uh, you have the Ethernet ports, yes. Giga gigabit or no? What kind of e Ethernet? 100 megabits, like standard Ethernet for industrial communication. Uh, two ports uh, to establish a redundant communication. And, and here uh, you see the Arduino shield. You can connect it to every uh, development board um, what provides an Arduino shield. So is this a new development board you have? or This is a new uh, solution kit what we will uh, have available by end of April of this year. And what would be the price in this? Uh, the price uh, of uh, the whole solution would be uh, 209 euros, which includes uh, the board itself and, and a whole software package uh, for the protocol stacks, as well as a tool to configure the module, to flash the module, and uh, yeah. So is the, idea, is the idea here that everything, in theory, could be inside this little box here? Everything is included in this little box. So the CPU, the ARM chip? The CPU, the ARM chip, everything you need for communication is included in this box. But you, and you can put it all kinds of different places? And, uh, yes. And okay. Like there? Yes. And uh, you, you just uh, have to solder it. Um, so the, the interface is a uh, serial interface, an SPI interface, and uh, you can solder it on every board. Is it an easy way to solder? Or how did it, where, where it's, is it solder? Uh, it's a uh, standard way to solder it. Yeah. Solder this part here? Or yes, what? you have to solder this part for, for mechanical reasons and uh, this part here for the uh, communication to the application controller. So, so what's, the, what's the market, target market for this? Is it something like this? It's in, yeah, it's industrial communication. Like industrial? Um, so are you already big in this market, doing a lot of things? And Yeah, we have. Uh, yeah, you can see here, we have an, a huge portfolio for industrial communication, yeah. uh, starting from a uh, um, chip solution based on uh, RZN, and um, up to the, to the module, you can establish different uh, applications in this, in this market.